SCP-408, aka Illusionary Butterflies. Object class, safe. Special Containment Procedures The screen mesh aviary must be kept pr properly maintained in by level 2 personnel with backgrounds in biology and laboratory. Proper humidity must be maintained and recorded once per day and back backed up to site 17. 200 feeders fill, fill with an egg. Oh yes, his sugar, sugar solution are to be maintained and refilled once per week. Description SCP 408 is a large, large mass of lip hotep. Topatera, taking the appearance of zebra butterflies when not camouflaged. SCP-408 acts as a single entity at all times, speculated to be a form of hive mind, mind communication amongst the mass. When inactive, SCP-408 will take on, on the color, blur pattern, and even texture of, of its immediate surroundings making them functionally invisible. When threatened, SCP-408 has been observed to take on the form, form and appearance of a non number of threatening creatures as a of defense method, including, including a pride alliance, a Tyrannosaurus Rex, and most notably SCP-682. See incident logs 682C. SCP-408 possesses the ability to communicate and reason, utilizing its ability to manipulate its color into to words and sentences to reply to, to research, researchers. IQ tests administered to, to SCP-408 has evaluated its IQ to be, be 109, or slightly above average. However, when, part, when a part of the form is isolated, lower score Reports have been reported, resulting in the theory that SCP-408 shares a cognitive, cognitive capacity amongst, amongst the entirety of, it, of the swarm. As a redacted, 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 SCP-408 prefers to be identified by, by its number. SCP-408 has was discovered in redacted Brazil after reports that locals and logging teams found their map. It has to be frequently inaccurate regarding the size of, of the rainforest. After reports of animal sightings not local to the Brazilian rainforest, and some found on Earth after all, Foundation agents began in an investigation resulting in the discovery of SCP-408. Learning thing it was intelligent, Dr. Redacted, who accompanied the agents with in the field, communicated with SCP-408 and convinced it to to accompany him into Site 17, with their current, current habitat, where their current habitat exists. Incident 408-A, due to a failure by a, by appropriate personnel to properly fill, refill SCP-408's feeders, the swarm took it upon itself for, to find substance by its own means, taking the appearance of a of several level 1 personnel, SCP-408 convinced a nearby convinced a passerby by to the open door to the A3, upon which they may made an escape to, into a, the Site 17 facility. For the whole day, Site 17 personnel reported in a large series of irregular events, ranging from color changing walls to several dozen versions of SCP-529, walking down the hallway. Site 17 was placed under lockdown and Delta level alert when it, it appeared that 90% of the containment units had been breached. Dr. Kontraki, head research of research for 408, had been been out on, on assignment that, that day. It wasn't until his return that the illusion had been revealed, and in short short order, SCP-408 had returned to its aviary. Little damage was done except to the faculty break room, which was left without proper sweet sweeteners for the next for the next week. 
No, it may be just sugar water, but without it, it for hey, 408 is prone to mischief as we clearly saw yesterday. It's fortunate that it doesn't cause maliciousy, but think about others next time when you slack off of custodial duties. Think about yourself as well. As I will not tell but having thing to, to use sweet and low though in my morning coffee before very long, Dr. Kondraki. Addendum 408-B. Recent field testing has shown that SCP-408 can act as an effective form of effective invisibility when ordered to. SCP-408 was able to conceal five level two, 2 personnel and keep them from undetected throughout the facility. Tests show the containment to operate at 99.99. Seven, some percent efficiency, and can be be maintained for up to five hours without the without need for or rest or recuperation. The the option of lending SCP-408 to task force for convert covert operations is is pending approval. Addendum 408-C. During Incident 239-B, Clive Kondraki, which SCP-408 was heavily involved, involved in, a number of corpses left by, by Dr. Her Clive vanished in the aftermath of the event. Surveillance showed that at certain times, an, the entire swarm of SCP-408 was would descend on the bo- the only to leave no trace trace of the corpse behind. Subsequent testing shows shows a proportional increase in IQ, although the lack of co- a lack of co- cooperation when questioned when questioned has shed no light on this development. Infu log four o a dash c Infuer doc- Dr. Sa- Shanghai. Interviewee SCP-408. Doctor Shanghai is seated within the aviary while SCP-408 hovers around on a large feeding thing through filled wa- filled with sugar water. I'll start off with that, with asking how you're recovering. You seem to have lost. Quite a bit of, ma- of your mass of the the SCP five thirty one dash D incident termination. SCP four oh eight responds by uniformly creating words one after another. Kondraki where? I'm a substitute substitute for the interview, as he happens to be busy adjusting thing to his new promotion. Lots of paper work I'm told. Moment goes by, I Fine, recover, good, food, good. How exactly do you replenish your, your numbers? Compl- another pause. Kate, he did, don't, don't know word. Was the doc- Dr. Mitro- Kondraki the one who taught you how to taught you to speak? Yes, teach. A lot. He taught you, but how do you communicate with him? Don't know. We're lost in space. You lost a part that that knew. Yes, I forget until return. Next question: What happened with SCP-091 dash dash arc and you during during the incident a few months ago? Pretty smell familiar a long time. You mean you smell it before? Yes. Before long long before people. Are you saying you predate human existence? No response from SCP four oh eight. Never mind. Doesn't matter. Last question. Doctor Sekai 
closes the interview questionnaire and said, down to the ground, what is the nature of your relationship with Dr. Kondraki? He think he right. He right. That's not what I meant. Long special so that you're with him. Out of, all, out of containment. Almost all, all the time now. Dr. Kondraki has been breaching protocol all by letting you out of containment. I don't know what. You're going to admit made this to me. I can I so I can bring it to it before oversight. Do you know what, what I was doing before for that schmuck to snatch me up? I meant an assistant. I was head of research for the entire subhuman safe safe SCP sector. Now I'm interviewing a damned insect. I will have him thrown out. Oversight won't let him, him get away with this. SCP-408. It proceeds to approximate the lab and describing the long, long ca character Earth face displayed as by SCP-408. Are you laughing at me? I'm about to have your little friend terminated. Are and you're having a chuckle? SCP-408 shifts to display a, imi a new image, which is presumed to be the live feed of Dr. Kondraki in his new office. No, that's not possible. I read the damn logs. You can't do that. You can't do that. Dr. Saghai attempts to damage SCP-408. Guards later found Dr. Saghai huddled in a fetal position, displaying symptoms similar to to PTS, PTSD. 